coming out. That was sick. You couldn't get in. We are filling the wubble bubble with smoke. Hey guys, welcome back to Incredible Science. Today we're gonna have some fun. I'm gonna take a wubble bubble, inflate it, and fill the entire thing with smoke. Yes, I've tried it before and I failed before, but I think I finally figured out how to do it. As far as yesterday's video and the pop socket giveaway, let me explain again. I have one to give away in today's video and then one in tomorrow's video and the day after, and I gave one away yesterday. I will contact you, but it's for the first person to comment the correct time that I say the word. So I would suggest turn on notifications, it's that little bell near subscribe, so that you'll know exactly when I post the video and you could be the first person to comment when I say the special word of the day. It could be any time in the video. Yesterday's word was pop, I said it about five and a half minutes in, a little bit later, and you will win your own Stay Incredible Pop Socket. Now, if you want one, you can go to incrediblescience.com and buy one there, but I will be giving these away right here in these videos. So, today's special word, it's gonna be somewhere in the video, and you have to find it. It's for the first person that comments the correct time below. The word today is incredible. I will say that word at some point in the video, and the first time I say that word, comment below and tell me what time I said it and I will send it to you. As simple as that. It's my way of saying thank you for being early and for watching these videos and yeah. So let's get on with the video. Now, the Wubble Bubble. I started this a couple weeks ago on my quest to fill it up with smoke because I haven't seen anyone do it. I've seen people fill it up with Mentos and Coke and soda. Well, that is Coke. And, and everything and water and I did water balloons even. That was actually a cool video. Slime and everything. But I thought it would be cool to see a Wubble Bubble filled with smoke. So, figured how, how hard could it be? I blew up the Wubble Bubble, I put a smoke bomb in it, and it was supposed to fill up the whole thing, but here's what happened. Okay. I think what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna light it, stick like stick it in halfway, light it, and then just drop it. I don't know if that'll I work would, or not, but. I, yeah, I'll do that, I, I, I'll, I'll do that. They may just like put it out. It in. We still have a lot more Wubble Bubble to inflate. This, there's a lot of rubber on this thing. As you saw, that did not work. The fire from the smoke bomb caused the hole in the wubble bubble. I should have realized that. So I redid it, and this time the plan was to wait for the fire to burn out and just have the smoke come out, and then drop it in the wubble bubble using the top of a Gatorade bottle. Put this in the wubble bubble so that the fire is not touching it, and as soon as the fire goes out, drop it down into the wubble bubble. Watch what happens. The wubble bubble inflated. And I'm gonna put a smoke bomb in it, smarter this time, so hopefully it should work. So that didn't work either. I guess there were some sparks coming out of the smoke bomb as it was laying. Maybe I should have shook it around, but it didn't work. There was another hole in it. So I was thinking, why not just take a smoke machine with no fire or anything, 
put the bubble bubble over it and fill it up with smoke that way. So we're gonna try that right now. I don't see any reason why it shouldn't work. I'm gonna inflate this right now, put this over the smoke machine, press the button, the whole thing should fill up with smoke. And then finally, we'll have a bubble bubble filled with smoke. So I'm using a high powered mattress pump. I find it blows up a lot quicker than the inflator that comes with the bubble bubble and the pump that comes with it. So let's get this open. That's the hardest part, to find the opening in the bubble bubble because you don't wanna rip it too much. And then put it in, blow it up, and then hopefully it'll fill up with smoke. I don't know if I was supposed to blow it up this big, but it's like blending it with the lights behind me. That's really cool. Actually, here we have a yellow wubble bubble, and here we have a pink wubble bubble. And now we have a blue, trying to get a blue wubble, okay. Anyway guys, here we have the wubble bubble. I'm going to try to get the smoke into it. Oh cool, I actually caught that. I'm gonna try to get the smoke into it. This thing is so light. I thought it would be heavier because it's so big, but all right. Here's the tricky part. I have to get the nozzle of the smoke machine into the wubble bubble. That's why I inflated a little extra so that in case some air comes out or when the air comes out, it'll still be fine. And then maybe throwing it off. Whoops. All right, here goes. Smoke machine's ready. I have to get the wubble bubble onto here though. Oh, I had it on and it slipped right off. It is on there, I don't know why. Here's the smoke. Oh, sick. We are filling a wubble bubble with smoke, guys. We did it. We did it, a wubble bubble filled with smoke. And it's staying in here. Not, that's so cool. I didn't have any smoke juice left, so I used I used the fog from my fog ring launcher. That is awesome. Make a really cool thumbnail now, ready? We got our thumbnail. So cool. Watch. Oh. It's like pushing against the smoke. Can you guys, can you guys see that? Watch the nozzle. Watch the smoke coming out of the nozzle and watch what happens as I go back and forth with this. See, it's like pushing it. I don't know if you guys can see that. So cool. This really looks like a smoky picture. This would be like a great Instagram shot. All right, so now what do we do with this? Should I cut it? I don't want to ruin it. But I guess in a way that was the whole point of filling it up, right? Maybe I could have like a little, if I put a straw, I wonder if I put a straw in the top and that'll act like a nozzle so we'll have smoke shooting out the top. Let's try that. So I don't have to destroy the wubble bubble and we can use it again for another experiment video but we can still see the cool smoke coming out of here. Let's try that. All right, that was the thumbnail. That looked pretty incredible. All right, now what I wanna do is put the straw in here and see if we can create some type of a nozzle to get the smoke and fog out. So let's try it right now. Here's my straw. I hope it'll work, because it would look really cool. Look at it, right on top there. Look at all, look at that smoke. Look at it, so cool. It's like your own smoke, wubble bubble smoke gun. That's what it is, it's a wubble bubble smoke gun. Yeah, I'm blowing straight at the camera. Do you see that smoke? Do you see that? It's so cool. Look coming out of the straw. It's like your own wubble bubble smoke machine. How to make a wubble bubble smoke machine. It actually, it's so cool. You know what? I'm so happy that the smoke bombs ripped the other two because I never would have came up with this one. I never would have had a, a wubble bubble smoke machine before and that's really cool. It's really cool to have this now. And, and the best part is you won't ruin the wubble bubble. So. So cool. Now, if you want to just open it, and you could stop at any time and just keep the smoke in there. So cool. 
Now, if we open it completely, watch. All the smoke's coming out. All the fog is coming out. That was sick. That's, you could like blast someone. Blast someone with smoke fog from the Wubble Bubble. This turned out so much cooler than I, than I, than I could have hoped for. Don't give up on anything. If you, if you hit a roadblock, if it doesn't work, just keep trying to find solutions and you will find the solution eventually. And it may even be cooler than you originally planned like this. So, Zeke, so learn lessons from Wubble Bubbles. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much for being here. Hit that subscribe button. Please give it a like if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to check out my vlog channel. I will see you tomorrow at 4 p.m. with another Pop Socket giveaway. Thanks so much for watching and don't forget, stay incredible. Peace.